Hey, what's going on everybody? Today I'm gonna teach you how to do frontside flips or the frontside 180 kick flip. This is a classic trick, and if you really get into skateboarding, you have to learn frontside flips. They are so much fun. Um, everybody has their own style, and yeah, I'm gonna give you my tips. So, the first thing when you do frontside flips, you wanna make sure you can frontside 180 and kick flip, like really well. Make sure your kick flips are super easy, super fluid, you have pop, and then make sure your frontside 180s are the same like make sure you're comfortable with them make sure you can rotate them all the way around if you're still kind of doing like a pivot you're not ready for a frontside flip so this trick takes two steps two steps of evolution okay so I noticed the thing that people do wrong with frontside flips is they kind of pivot them and they kind of don't try to throw the trick in between their legs now obviously you don't want to have a frontside flip that just is like a hard flip and then you turn your body because that looks bad. But when you're first learning, it's a lot better to throw the frontside flip vertical in between your legs because when you're a little kid and you're a little bit shorter, it's kind of scary to throw the frontside flip in between your legs. You think you're going to like popsicle or you think you're going to like, you know, hit your balls or whatever. Um, but you need to get comfortable with throwing the board underneath your legs because that's gonna open up the door to having more control on your frontside flips. It's gonna help with hard flips, all that stuff. Um, you definitely don't wanna learn frontside flips where you kinda try to like 180 kick flip it, you know? You kinda wanna like throw it in between your legs like that. So first we're gonna get into the foot positioning for the frontside flip. Um, you wanna make sure you put your front foot kind of in the middle, a little bit lower than a kick flip, and you wanna put your back foot kind of in the corner, a little bit above the pocket. So, the simple explanation to this trick is, is you want to kind of lean back as you pop, not too much. You want to scoop the board down and forward, and then right here, this is the secret part, you want to flick off the corner, and the goal is to make the board flip right under your knee. So you want your, your flick to go outside, and you want the board to go underneath you. And this is gonna be really scary, so to practice it, just throw it in front of you and just bail it, like a bunch of times. And if you can't get the full 180, just lean back and shove the board farther in front of you. Once you start landing a bunch of them like this, and you feel the board flipping vertical, like straight underneath your legs, now you're ready to kind of fine tune the trick and make it look really, really good. And if you wanna see some examples of a really good frontside flip. Um, I personally think Seva Krotkov, he's a professional skater. He has, in my opinion, the best frontside flip in the game. Um, obviously, Andrew Reynolds has one of the best frontside flips. Um, another guy, you know, some Colorado love is Tyler Price. He has a really good frontside flip. And when you look at their frontside flips, they don't go completely vertical, but they don't go completely sideways. They're kind of in the middle. So they throw them and they catch them sideways and then they turn the rest of the 180 and it just looks really, really good. So once you're comfortable with throwing the front side flip in between your legs, you're ready to kind of flick them sideways and catch them and turn. So the only thing that you need to do differently is when I initially showed you the foot setup, you just want to move your foot farther like a kick flip. And that's just going to allow to get more friction on your flick, which is gonna make the board go more sideways like this. So all you have to do is play around with how much you scoop the board forward and your flick. So when you're throwing them vertical, you flick almost at a 90 degree angle. When you want them to catch sideways, you flick at a 45 degree angle and you move your foot farther on the board. Um, I'm gonna play some examples in slow motion of ones that I catch more sideways, but if you really wanna see a good front side flip, Check out Seva, check out Andrew Reynolds, maybe some Tyler Price. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it for the frontside flip. This trick is super fun and it's one of my favorite tricks to do down stuff. When you flip it and catch it sideways, it's just, it's amazing. So I hope you enjoyed this trick tip. If you have any other trick, trick requests, make sure to comment them below and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.